the U.S. must accept that China may be the number one. But basically, this idea that there should be a dominant country is not very acceptable. All countries must have an equal say, especially in the United Nations, because of the power of the five uh, veto powers, uh, a lot of good things cannot be done. So this competition between China and the U.S. is damaging towards international trade. And we hope that uh, they should um, reach agreement among them uh, to make sure that uh, their, uh, their relationships become uh, much better. Already we see Australia is now uh, uh, working to improve relationship with China. I think the US should do the same. There's not very much that ASEAN can do except to try and contact, keep contact with the military and try to persuade them that uh, they can retain power without being oppressive towards their own people. They should accept that even in a democratic system, the military can still be very powerful. We need to have young people know the history of the country so that they will appreciate the struggle for independence and how we manage to develop the country. Uh, when they know that, I think they will continue the process and the country will become better developed. In many countries, they elect governments which are not very capable. Uh, they don't know how to manage the economy, how to grow the country. And because of that, they um, tend to borrow a lot of money and uh, to use the money to, uh, to pay for development, but at a very high price. Uh, the management of finance is something that is lacking in many of these countries. They should learn to live with their own ability, not to borrow too much. Because borrowing will uh, result in uh, problems of uh, payment. And if you don't pay, then you, of course uh, the country may be bankrupted. I think what is important is moderation in life. Uh, you don't overeat. You must do sufficient exercise. You don't get angry or you don't get very uh, uh, emotional uh, all the time. Also, you must always be, be thinking a lot, reading, writing, debating, uh, and uh, using your brain all the time.